We're back with Henry Wembley. He has his sidekick. Uh, Brooke is back with us. <laughs> I mean, I spoke about kittens earlier, and then one appeared. Yeah. So. Voila. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> Magic. Yeah, we have a whole crew today. <laughs> I think you're out of the doghouse, by the way. Uh, Henry, I am. Yeah. I got the word that uh, Brooke needed a cat today. So yeah, we you had, better we listen. We, we, we listen to Brooke. Yeah, yeah. So I uh, hope she'll take it home. We're hoping. We're hoping. Well, we're collecting a fund for her well, right now. Right. Pet <laughs> <deposit. laughs> that deposit fund if you guys want to contribute. I told her she's going to get the money, get all of the money. Get the <laughs> there you go. Good Pet strategy. deposit plus oh. the adoption fee. But it's, the kid looks like she's already found a home with Brooke. Yeah. Well, she's kind of like hiding she's up in the blanket. right at home there. She, Brooke brought the blanket out, so she's been cold Aww. enough inside the blanket if we can get her to come out. That's yeah. right. She's a bit camera shy. She is yes. camera shy. Uh, Unlike her future mom. <laughs> now, she came from not. A, she came from a litter of four, and this is the only female. The oh other three God. are males, and all of them came in together. So uh, they're about five weeks old, going on six weeks now. Oh, that's so precious. Well, that is this a precious the, these are the first kittens we've gotten in quite a while. Hmm. So the spring is coming, right? Yeah, well, coming. spring is here. Uh, <laughs> so hopefully, it won't be uh, uh, the first of many. Right. But if they are, then we'll have you know plenty of kittens laid on. This oh, why is, is yeah. Kid. Why is the why is that? Well, uh, nature's such that they're generally not born in the winter time. Okay. In the spring, that's when all the newborns come, and mm -hmm. we usually get a big influx of kittens and puppies in the springtime of the year. Well, now you have the puppies. Yes. I love the color of this. And she's so chatty. <laughs> yes, she is. <laughs> she is, isn't she? But she's going to grow up to be a pretty good-sized cat, mm -hmm. hopefully, in uh, someone's, you know, home. And oh yeah, she'll get a good place. Yes. So today after 11.30, they can come by. And if they miss this one, as I say, we have three other ones available, really? pretty oh much the goodness. same color pattern. And they can uh, take a cat home today. What type of dogs do you have available right now? Well, we have little dogs, big dogs, various breeds, mm -hmm. mostly terriers. Uh, uh, I think we have some maybe a Shih Tzu, Shih Tzu mixes, something like that. Then we have some larger dogs up for adoption now, some real nice large dogs, a little bit older, but they are excellent pets. And as I said earlier, some of them have been owned by people and have been spayed or neutered already, which is a plus, and that would reduce the cost of the adoption. Yeah. Well, pets are so wonderful for family company. Yeah, they are, and they, they do so much to improve the quality of life for people, and it shows caring when you have pets. I think it's wonderful house. also for children because it teaches them responsibilities. It does, and if my wife was an only child, so when she was coming up, she had a dog as a companion around uh -huh. the house. So well, sure. it could be a companion animal for a child that's an only child. This little kitten is right at home with Brooke. Yes. Look at that. They well, just after she's done griping, but <laughs> she'd fit right into my yeah, house. Yes, she she does. would. <laughs> it's me and cat farm right yeah, here. She'd be a perfect yeah. companion. Yeah, she's, a, she's a cat person. I'm she telling is. you. Yeah, I like dogs too, person. but yeah, it, it just, we, we've had cats in recent years, so yes. I think I've kind of. A certain weakness we had all cats. sorts of pets, yeah. truthfully. Uh, cats are more low maintenance than dogs. They don't, you know, require as much as dogs do. So, and most people that have cats keep them indoors. So important to spay and neuter your, your pets. Correct. Always spay and neuter. And every pet that leaves the animal shelter has to be spayed and neutered, which that's part of the law in controlling the overpopulation of animals. Thanks, Henry. Thank and, you. Uh, I think you're back in Brooks' good graces. Okay. Uh, I think you're back in Brooks' good <laughs> graces. <laughs> Out of the doghouse. Yes. That's right. Good job today. Thank you. Appreciate you being here. Thank you very so much. Well. Thank we'll you. wrap wrap things up in just a second.